what's going on it's me back at it making a new video for y'all this one's going to discuss a couple of things that i wanted to show you guys and talk to y'all about uh recently i've had a few emails and dms about um possible causes and solutions and diagnostics for oil consumption right so one of the big ones that i've had is how do i know if my actual valve cover is bad um, or if it's just my turbo or what's going on so i want to show you guys a quick and easy way to figure it out yourself on both applications on this uh, stock location uh, turbo and then i'm going to show you guys on a top mount turbo all right guys we're going to go here on a stock turbo m240 b58 gen 1 uh, if you're able to pull off this hose right here by squeezing it down on both sides You can actually take this off and what I like to do is zip tie a sock on here a white sock is great uh, Make sure it's not your little brother sock or something something that you can throw away Because what's gonna happen is if your valve cover is bad Most of your oil is gonna shoot straight out of here. and It'll be a ton of it So that's a good way to separate that from your turbo because if you do leave that on what's gonna happen is gonna shoot up into the intake and uh of the charge pipe and then you're gonna have issues with figuring it out if it's your turbo or your valve cover um, now another way to do that if you don't see any oil coming out of here would be to um, plug that up and disconnect your charge pipe at either here or from the turbo which is gonna be a little tighter and just see if you got oil all up intact and if you do that's chances that you're um, that your turbo is blowing oil through your system through your intercooler and let's see what else we got yes the last thing i was going to show you guys to know if a lot of you guys are having issues with misfires not knowing if you have low compression you got oiling issues the first thing i like to do is just tell you guys to go ahead and start with a compression check All right and you guys most of you guys know how to do that you can google that but you know take out the spark plugs um cold pack spark plugs go ahead and do you want to just amazon you can get one of those amazon compression gauges and um, test your cylinders and that should tell you if you got a bad ring you know which could be another issue why have you, why you have so much oil and uh, misfires and um i guess oil consumption overall so those are kind of three things that i wanted to talk about and if you're in the process of diagnosing um, some sort of oil consumption issue, oil shooting out all over your engine bay. All right, guys, now we're looking at a more, I guess, custom setup here, which would be a big top mount um, or even a big bottom mount. You can have similar setup as this. The difference is this hose actually doesn't shoot into the intake, but rather um, into this fuel vapor, um, fuel vapor hose. So yeah, same thing, disconnect here. Just see if you got oil shoot out of here. And then actually on these turbos, super easy to disconnect. You just see if you got oil shooting up through here. I know the car's a mess, this is actually my daily right now. And a very, very easy way on you guys who have a PCV aftermarket install here. This is actually vented out to the back of the car. If your valve cover is working, you should see smoke vapor coming out of here. Um, very light, very light uh, white smoke coming out. I'm showing your crankcase is actually venting out. And if you don't, that means that you have a blockage somewhere, which will lead you to test out, you know, the low side PCV right here. Um, and if that's got no vapor and it's shooting out of here, then you know it's your valve cover. If those both things are both working, unplug the charge pipe, check oil in there. And then most likely it could be your turbo but besides that um that's a few ways that you can test yeah, it out like always hopefully, hopefully that gives you a little bit of insight on how to diagnose your car how to get some issues worked out um, if you do have any other questions hit me up on once cars on instagram or um just comment on youtube video and i should try to be able to answer some questions but hey i went through this headache a ton and the last thing is i want is, is, is for you guys to have to deal with the same thing that i did for so long so you know check this video reference it out and uh hit me up if you got any questions talk to y'all later thanks for watching